Hey everybody, it's Patricia and welcome back to my channel. Today, what we are going to do is use the items that I frankened in my last two franken videos. Uh, one, I made a contour shade. And let me show you if I can get it open here. I made this contour shade. So we are going to use that. And then I made a little, I made a blush and an eyeshadow. And uh, I've had requests um, wanting to know how these items are working, how they're performing. So I've gone ahead and done part of my makeup. I'm uh, going to go ahead, we're gonna put the contour on, uh, the blush, and then uh, the eyeshadow. And then I'll finish doing my makeup and then we'll discuss uh, what we think. So first, I'm going to grab this contour shade. Now this was made, I used a contour color from a Pro, uh, Profusion uh, palette that I purchased that I didn't care for. Let's go under the chin. Uh, I didn't like how this performed. So I mixed it with a Kat Von D powder and uh, I have to say I have been using this and I really like it. It performs much better. It's very blendable. Um, the one before, it just like, when I put it on, my skin just grabbed that color and I couldn't blend it out. I couldn't, couldn't get smooth edges. This one is very, very good. I'm very happy. It's what made me excited about frankening some other items. So yeah, it's, um, the perfect pigment color for me. I can build it up. I can start out light if I want. But yeah, I'm extremely, extremely happy with my new contour shade. Very happy. Next, uh, let's go ahead and do the blush. This blush was from a palette I purchased from um, Beauty Bay. It was from a palette called um, the company was the Beauty Crop, and I forgot what the name of the palette was, but those eyeshadows, I, I didn't like them at all. I didn't think they performed great at all. And so I took two different shades. I took a red, I think it was a red, red no, it was a hot pink and an orange. Mixed them together with some uh, powder from my Kat Von D face palette. This, the one I was just using, I mix this powder with those two eyeshadows and got this blush and I have to say this is my favorite blush right now. It works great. I love the shade. Look at that. It is just so pretty. Look at that. A little across my nose. Look, just a little bit is all I need. I love it, I love it. Now, the one I haven't tried at all. Uh, I made it, didn't try it. It's this um, dark navy eyeshadow. I used a blue from that same Beauty Crop palette and I used a dark brown. It had a little bit of shimmer in it. The other, that palette from Beauty Crop is all, uh, well, no, it has some shimmers in it, but I used all mattes. Um, the dark brown was from a Tarte palette called Dream Big. So, I mixed those two together. So, we're going to do my eyes today. With that, I'm going to use my Sigma Beachy palette, which has a, a color pretty similar, but it's very um, shimmery. But let's go ahead. I've already put on my... Oh, I'm having a hot flash. Sorry, guys. If I seem to look a little red. Hot flash time. But I put on uh, the uh, shade from my Project Pan palette. I'm panning. That was a mouthful. Uh, and um, to set my base, my eyeshadow primer. So, now I'm going to start with this new shade. This new color. And I'm going to apply it my outer V 
Let's see how well it did. I'm going to work it into my crease just a bit. I don't want an all blue look. Now, I don't know if it's because I am actually sweating. Can you see, guys, how hot I am? I'm actually sweating. I don't know if that's affecting it, but it's not wanting to blend very well, unfortunately. It is not. I don't know if it's a hot flash or the fact that our temperature today is supposed to be 97 with a heat index of like a hundred and something. I don't know. Whew. My goodness. First impressions is, but I am sweating. I mean, can you see I actually have water? I'm sweating. Um, first impressions was it did not want to blend very well. Um, I think I will have to do this one again when I am not having this massive hot flash. I'm going to go ahead. I'm not going to put any more of that blue on. I'm going to go ahead and put some more eyeshadow on and then we'll be back and play with the blue a little bit more. Maybe that will help. My eyelids may not be so sweaty. So I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I put some um, brown in my um, crease area, transition and crease area. So hopefully um, that works good. And then I'm going to try a little more of this blue and see if that helps it. Yeah, okay. I think it's because I am sweating. I actually had to wipe off my face. I was sweating so bad. And I still am that hot. It's crazy ceiling fans going and I didn't turn it off because I just couldn't it, it's just too hot it's just too hot here so and I have the air on the air can't keep up with how hot it is outside there we go okay I think it blends really nice I'm gonna take a um, little detail brush is that small enough? No. Let's get a small one. I'm going to take that blue and go under my lower lash line with it. It's a very pretty shade. It's what I was going after. It does have just a... It, it, I used a dark brown that has sparkle, like I said. But it's not really showing up as sparkle on my eyes so I like that it's showing up as a matte shade which I really wanted a matte shade I didn't want a shimmer well what do you guys think okay I need to finish my eye look because I have nothing on my lids except for that I think I'm going to go easy I'm just gonna take my finger and go into this light shade just pop it on here Okay, I'm going to go finish my makeup, and then I'll come back, and we can discuss all these. Okay, there we go. I like how it turned out. Um, let me see if I can zoom you in this way. I hope you can see my eyes. Yeah, I I am liking, I like that eyeshadow. I like it a lot. I think I was just, I was sweating so bad there for a moment. Gosh, hot flashes in the hot summer are not, in, not a joke. So anyway, I like how my eyeshadow turned out today. I like that color I made and it does perform a lot better. I, I like the eyeshadow. I love my blush. Absolutely love the blush. Love the color I came up with. And I really like the contour shade. Um, I didn't do anything to affect the, sh the color of the contour shade. Because I really like the color it was. I just didn't like how it performed. 
it, the mixing the powder made it just a slight bit lighter, but not really. Mainly the powder uh, made it perform better. So, gosh, I, I really like this look. I really like this eyeshadow a lot. So, guys, I think next week I will try to franken maybe a couple more eyeshadows or maybe another blush. Um, I don't know. So, guys, what do you think? Uh, if y'all enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. That helps out my channel a whole lot. If you are new here, I would really love it if you would subscribe and come hang out with me. I love making new friends and I love it when uh, I get new subscribers. So, I uh, appreciate it. Any questions, comments, anything, leave them down below. I try to answer each and every one. I will, if I can't, if it's something I can't really uh, it's not a question or anything I can really go into detail. I'll, I'll give you a bunch of hearts. I always give a bunch of hearts because that's who I am. So guys, thank y'all for watching. I'll see you next time.